Work late, but you didn't wait up My bones ache, I'm cleaning the place up Sometimes I don't even know why I care I sit down, I take off my makeup I lay down, but you don't wake up Sometimes I wonder if you know I'm there I can't remember the last time you told me I'm beautiful And I can't remember the last time that you said anything at all Cervical cancer is the fourth most common cancer among women. According to the World Health Organization, an estimated number of 604,000 women were diagnosed of this disease worldwide and a number of 342,000 women died out of this disease. As a result, there is a need for every woman to know their health status through screening. Because of this, the School of Nursing of Wisconsin International University College, Kumase Campus, has organized a cervical screening for the Bosomche district. We are currently at Aputuja where the screening is ongoing. We will bring you videos and reactions. My name is Veronica Abraham and I'm here with this is Wisconsin TV Ghana. Stay tuned. Actually, I do know of cervical cancer and I know that is a very important test every woman should undertake, especially those from 18 to 30, I'm sorry, 18 to 65. And since I'm within that age and I heard about this amazing program, I said, why not? Oh, actually, it's going to benefit me in the sense that I know early detection saves lives. Early detection saves lives. So this is an amazing opportunity. I couldn't let it pass by. So I know obviously based on my result being negative, I'm free and I know I also need to recheck in the next three years. So boy, and fast so was so fine, fast so was so bad. My wife, so we now have no company in Arabia and you know, so now my wife say, oh you okay? So we can from Mobi I say we are Don't put shyness before your health, okay? Because we all don't know whether we have the cervical cancer or not until you are screened. And then if you, do, if you don't screen to it, it will be too late and to be your death. So please, let's all push shyness aside and come for screening. So what benefit do you think um, those who got a chance to be screened will have? Enormous benefit because I learned that it is a very dangerous kind of disease. Uh, today they were seeing that it's caused by a virus and you know this viral attacks it takes sometimes a very long time for, the, uh, for it to go away. Sometimes it doesn't even go away and the person suffering from this may even lose her life. We, we don't want people to lose their lives for things that we can do something about. Most people are not aware of the fact that this survival cancer thing is sexually transmitted and one good thing about it is that it can be treated but then because of the location of the cervix in the female reproductive system if, if when the condition starts you cannot see it and because of that you will not be able to tell that this thing has started so i need to go to the hospital so that i'll be treated on time but most women like i said are, adv are diagnosed at the advanced stage where they are bleeding having lower abdominal pains and other things so a lot of them will fall on these herbal preparations and the rest but the condition is such that we have to do something about it and we realize from our studies that one of the major things to help 
in, in detecting the condition at early stage was health education and screening. And we asked ourselves during lectures, how expensive is health education? It wasn't. Okay, so what did you achieve after the screening? It's very, very amazing. You see, we went there not suspecting any of the women who came for the screening. At the end of the day, we got three women who tested positive, who were positive. So it means that they can be treated they, and they will be fine and free from this condition. They will live and take care of their families and their children. As you can see, getting screened might be the only way for us to go as women. Get screened today and prevent yourself from cervical cancer. This video was sponsored by Wisconsin International University College, Kumasi Campus, for your degree and master's program. It's Wisconsin. My name is Veronica Abraham and I was here with Christiana. This is Wisconsin TV. You know.